Start your turd! Come any closer, I'll call you up. Oh, my day! There you are, hmm? Jock. Yeah, I got you that stuff. Oh, great! Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm -hmm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's no nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under Celebs wheels. <laughs> no, no, well, she can throw herself under my wheels anytime. <laughs> oh, I knew you were funny, John. Yeah. I knew I would like you. C can I have a hug? Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Come here. Uh, I've got a p protruding hip. It's not a semi. Nigel! John! No. You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Al Dinapoli walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Oh, me! I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck. And we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. Is it like that little lockup I know. No problemo. Look, there he is! Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me! Oh, to the chariot! Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away! Come on, Jock, get in! Hurry, we're going to lose him! Did you ever imagine we might get a... Private audience with Al Di Napoli? Only in my wildest dreams. All those nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known. I loved him in the Redeemer. Oh, Nigel, do your Al Di Napoli line. This 
He's not much use to us in a body bag, Jock. Glad to see you on the proper side of the road, dear boy. I hear that behind his charitable public face, he's remarkably right-wing. One can but hope. Liberal in the bedroom, conservative at the border, Mrs. Thornhill. <laughs> I love this country. Earth will we feed the man? I hadn't even thought of that. He probably eats sushi or quinoa. Is that even how you say it? What if he wants meth? Don't get flustered again, Nigel. You'll have another turn. Oh, oh, I gotta get my eyes checked. You'll have another turn. Ah! Find out! He's going into the car park! The car park! No worries, mate! Careful! Oh, I hope he likes us. How could he not? This lockup you prepared sounds charming. Just be yourself, Mrs. Thornhill. Oh, my giddy aunt. Everything okay there, Earl Crazy Cakes? My prostate has taken quite a beating. Do you have to lower the tone? Don't go crazy. We'd prefer him in one piece. Oh, yeah. Nobody here go crazy. Heaven forbid. The higher car. This must be second nature to you, Jock. All those stunts you used to do. This level of derangement, I'm impressed. Little by little, I'm tipped. Is he going through the hospital? Oh, my lord! Hold on to your corsets! Uh, seems rude not to follow him through the window. Bloody hell! Such a thrill! Ah, uh, would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. Oh, come here, you! Come on! Come on! Let me meet your biggest fan! Ah. Oh, you're fucking crazy! Oh, it's Get off me! me. <laughs> you're good to go! Ah, a true gentleman! This is so exciting! Nut jobs. Mm. 